Hey guys, how's it going? Today I want to do just kind of a quick review for you guys on the solder double door storage cabinet. Um, I hadn't seen too many reviews on it, so I thought I'd just kind of give you guys my two cents. Just kind of based off my experience and let you know what I thought about it. Uh, sh oh, should mention quick, real quick too, I found a pretty good deal on this. I'll put a link below to that in the description. So you can check that out if you're interested in getting one for yourself. So Solder, if you're not familiar with them, um, they're kind of an online furniture brand. Um, they sell most, most of their stuff exclusively through Amazon. Um, and their whole thing was kind of like the Ikea model to an extent. Make really good quality stuff that's fairly cheap, actually really cheap for what you're getting, but of still really good quality. Uh, and this storage cabinet's no exception. It's very well made. Um, they don't use cheap parts with it. It feels very solid. It feels actually, in my opinion, looks and feels better than a lot of in-store furniture that I've bought in the past. One cool thing I really like about this is the open cabinet. Uh, one of the sides, the right side of the cabinet itself, it opens up and it has drawers inside the door itself. It's kind of a neat feature. It's something you kind of need to use to appreciate, but it just lets you get to stuff. Uh, it, it, it opens stuff up quite a bit more because if you think about it, you're like, it's almost like you're cutting the cabinet in half and being able to open it up all the way so you can fit twice as much stuff without having to reach behind and get stuff. So it's great for like pantries if you're going to use it for that, if you want a freestanding pantry or office supplies or really anything uh, it can be used for. And then the left door is just more of a traditional door uh, that you can fit bigger things in. The cabinets are fully adjustable as far as the slats go. There's holes on the side about every inch, inch and a half. So you can adjust the, uh, the shelves inside to hold whatever size stuff you got or you're going to put in there. But it has a really nice look, very well made. Uh, this thing is pretty heavy. It's made of some heavy duty particle board. Uh, it weighs 140 pounds. So keep that in mind. Um, it's not that it's hard to build, but if you have to move it or carry it, I just slid mine uh, using some moving men and it was no problem. Um, but if you do have to move the cabinet later, it is pretty heavy. But that's kind of true of all these things. Everybody uses particle board now. So yeah, but the, um, the actual Formica finish on it, the laminate, is really good. Um, pretty heavy duty, looks good, stands up to scratch as well. Uh, should mention too that it, it was actually pretty easy to assemble. A lot of these things are a pain in the butt, but not the case with this one. Uh, pretty quick to assemble, maybe better part of an hour. But yeah, very happy with it. Uh, highly recommend it if you're looking for a really good uh, cabinet slash pantry uh, with that little door feature, which is awesome. Anyway, if you have any more questions about it, just leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching, guys, and have a great day.